Back here at home, a community is in mourning after a 15-year-old girl was killed in a car crash on Long Island. Police tell us the driver was intoxicated when he slammed into an SUV carrying the girl along with several other people who were hurt. CBS 2's Leah Mishkin has the story from Woodmere. The crash happened behind me last night around 11 p.m. Everyone we spoke with is in shock, including residents of this area that we spoke with who told us they heard the noise and they rushed out to try to help. I just come out fast. I not even put no jacket. I come out fast and I try to help the, 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 the people right there. Surveillance video shows a white SUV making a left turn when it gets hit by a pickup truck. It happens at the intersection of Peninsula Boulevard and Edward Avenue. Very sad, you know, very sad. There were five passengers inside the SUV that got hit, including the 15-year-old girl who died. Her name has not yet been released by police. The driver of the pickup truck has been charged with driving while intoxicated, in addition to vehicular manslaughter. As a father, a grandfather, 15-year-old child disappearing from the face of the earth. For what? What a horrible, horrible tragedy. Dove Hikins, a former New York State Assemblyman who lives in the area, says this isn't the first time there's been a crash in this part of Woodmere. I spoke to uh, the new county executive, Bruce Blakeman, who is very concerned. He said starting tomorrow, there are going to be uh, police all over the place here, uh, and they're going to look at what needs to be done. I pray for, for, for everybody. Mm -hmm. for the for, for the girl who, who died I pray yeah. for the for the family and for everybody and I don't know I don't know I don't know what's going on I, oh, so the police got to be figured out the driver of the SUV a 38 year old woman was taken to an area hospital in critical condition the rest of the passengers police say were also taken to the hospital with less severe injuries in Woodmere Long Island Leah Mishkin CBS 2 news